the moment you notice drapes on your designs just know that it was caught on bias you see this dress this cowl it was definitely caught on the bias screen even this one you see how it even has like extra extra drapes definitely caught on the bias screen now you see the way this one just falls nicely and follows her body then at the hem you notice like some kinds of waves and all that's what happens to your fabric when you cut on the bias screen so fabric that would have had some structure starts to fall and drape because you cut on the bias screen so that's the reason why some of the designs that you make do not turn out the way they were supposed to because you did not cut on the right grain you probably cut them on the vertical or horizontal grain or direction of your fabric and then it ended up not giving you what you wanted for this particular skirt if you're going to make the pattern it would be a line but then if you cut that a line pattern on the straight green it will not give you this effect it is the bias green that gives you this you know the way it falls and the waves at the hem if you have ever wanted to make this skirt design and it not quite turn out the way it was supposed to it was because you cut on the wrong green please when you want to drape pleats on your design make sure you cut the piece of fabric that you want to pleat on the bias screen. That's what gives it that fullness, that depth you see in the pleats. If you try to do it on the straight green, just don't to avoid stories that touch. Also, if you want to do belts and all that go across the body like this particular design, also make sure you cut that belt in the bias screen. I hope this helps and I hope you actually remember this tip the next time you try to create designs that drape and also contour the body of the woman. And if you want to learn more tips and tricks like this, why aren't you following this page already? This is where you learn them. Bye!